tool or my Lotus 100. Like I said, sorry, it's been my thing. I don't know. So today I had church this morning and we had like 15-20 people in the congregation and three choir members. <laughs> So one of them didn't sing, and the other one and I sang a duet, and he sang a solo. I didn't sing a solo because I didn't have one prepared, but if I did, I probably would have sang. But I sang a duet with him, and so that was super fun. And now they're going to be on vacation for two weeks, and I'm going to miss them. Next Sunday, I'm not going to be in church anyway because I'm going on my trip. And I know I said that my last vlog would be my last vlog, but I really want to vlog just dedicated to this trip because I don't know how much I'm going to film or take pictures and like so this will be maybe the last vlog. We are leaving Saturday afternoon and I won't even tell you what the plan is yet because I want you guys to be surprised. So I'm going to take you with me um spring cleaning my room. Wow. <sighs> But first of all, I'm going to show you what I already have done. So. so I have my dresser done. Sup. So this cute outfit actually came from Romway. Romway? Romway? I don't know how you actually say it. But it is my mirror. I washed my mirror because it was bad because it had a giant stain like right there. <laughs> And I cleaned off my dresser top. So there's my little candle. And then that thing got reorganized. And that side got reorganized because I put up that picture of me and my friend Rachel when uh, we were in, t I was in 10th grade and she was in 9th. And then of course I have that. My sheets are currently in the dryer. And that's why my bed looks like that. This pile of stuff right here of all stuff that I am getting rid of. And so then I organized this over here. Look at how much cleaner that looks. I'm so proud of that. Except my work uniform goes in there, so. But that is also currently in the dryer. And that looks so much neater because I took my onesies and put them in the other room since it's not winter anymore and I'm probably not going to be using them. And I mopped my floors, like this whole area, even over there. So all of this has been mopped, and this is the section that I'm going to do next. This is like my blankets and stuff, so I don't mind that. And this. So all this is going to get mopped next. And I also did my closet. So if you can tell, it looks a lot more emptier. And up there looks a lot better. I took my snacks into the kitchen <laughs> where they belong. Took a lot of stuff out that I didn't really want anymore, and most of it is in there. That's mostly just garbage. This has got some random stuff in it. It is letters, but it has some random stuff in it too. So, let's see how this turns out in one, two, didn't work as well as I planned it was gonna. Lori, that is the after look. And I mopped the rest of this, so up to here I have just to, and I did mop by my door, I have to mop that corner. I don't want to do that corner. Ow. I mop there, and then I can start on this hecticness we call the sleeping side. And I also have to sort that black thing in there. Oh, I have to show you guys this. This is my mother's shirt that I made for her for her high school reunion. She's going to Florida in June for her high school reunion. If you guys didn't know, you probably didn't. And that's her school. And this is her school color, blue and gold. Apparently it was dark blue, but... And then it has her name on it. So, oh, well. So I am super... That looks super cute. I'm so excited. I have to wash that mirror that's in there, hey guys, and fix my lights, and then this half of the room besides that should be done, so let's do it. Okay guys, so it is time to tackle this 
disastrous half side of the room. Since this one's all clean, hi. Oh yeah, don't mind me wearing cat ears. It's cute. So I'm gonna get out my nifty tripod so that I can film some. This part all mopped and cleaned, and even the night side table. And I have this big pile of dirt right here. It's like my fourth big pile of dirt. There's probably more underneath my dresser. That's for another day. <laughs> now I just have to clean off the bed. I did make it, but now I just have to clean it off, make it look neat again. is the drawer that I use every day. I don't need too much because it's already pretty organized. This is all night shirts and skirts. This is shirts, pants, and more obviously, and tank tops. This is my dance drawer. And <laughs> Over here, this area. That's my mom's Mother's Day present. Shh. And then all that. It just pretty much looks the same. And then we have my closet. It's my recital costume. And all my clothes. And pretty self explanatory. So, my room is officially clean. The only thing I didn't do was this thing. And I probably should because I had to reorganize that black thing in there. But, I mean, other than that, it's, it's fine. So. Hey, y'all. That was so weird. I'm just going to keep saying, hey, you guys. So, it is midnight. It is currently April 19th. Five days until I turn 21. So excited. Two more days until my big trip. So, today is technically Thursday. So, I have Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and I'm working. And then Saturday, I'm leaving. And Sunday, you'll finally get to know where I'm going. I've been keeping this a secret from you guys for so long and those of you who actually watch my videos maybe you're suspicious and can't wait to see where I'm going because it is a pretty big trip for me so I am currently writing up my packing list and I have some of them checked off because I have started packing already I'm going to do a what's in my suitcase video on Friday Friday, probably Friday. I had a very long day yesterday. I worked from 7 a.m. until 2, had a doctor's appointment at 3, and then danced from 6 until 8.30. So it was a long, long day. Today, I have... It's not going to be as long because I don't go in until 2, but I also get out at 5.45, so I'm not even working for 4 hours. 
but then I have dance from 6.30 to 7.45, and then it's Grey's Anatomy. I'm so excited. And then Friday, which is tomorrow, I work 3.30 to 8, which is four and a half hours, which I guess is not all that bad at all. And Saturday I'm working 7 to 10.15, which I'm not looking forward to because I don't like, I mean, I like the early shifts, but, but I don't like being the first cashier. Um, I don't know, it just feels weird. So, anyway, yeah, I finally organized that black little organizer thingy right there, so. So, I think Bree's going to upload on Biflat TV soon, which means I'm going to be uploading on Biflat TV soon. And I can't wait to upload my room tour. That is not my next video, but I can't wait to upload it. So, I've just bored you guys for three and a half minutes, so... <laughs> Bye! I will probably film before I edit this video. So, stay tuned for fun! So, last clip of this vlog. So... My throat's a little sore and my nose is a little stuffy this morning, but hopefully that'll go away. Because in two days, I get to leave. But, I wanted to upload this vlog today so that tomorrow, before I go to work, I can do a What's in My Suitcase video and then upload that really quickly. <clears throat> so that Saturday I had time to do all my last minute things after I get out of work before I leave. But, I am super excited. I'm still not going to announce where I'm going. You will see where I'm going when I get there. Um, so like I said, probably, like I probably said in previous clips, we are having a birthday dinner for me at my aunt's house on Saturday. But I probably won't film that. Maybe I'll have my mom saying happy birthday to me. I don't know. Like, my mom record them saying happy birthday to me. Um, but I don't know if I'm going to record much at my aunt's house just because I'm only allowed to film one of my cousins. And the rest of my family doesn't want to be on camera. So, yeah. Meanwhile, there's going to be five of my second cousins. My first cousin. Um, and I don't know if her husband's going to come. Um, my mom, my aunt, and my uncle, and possibly one of my aunt's friends, who we call Meme, because she's basically related to us, because she's over there all the time, and she treats us like we're her kids. Like, so, I want to do a question of the day for you guys real fast, or a question of the, question of the vlog, So I'm going to call it, question of the vlog. So... The question of the vlog is, where is the most exciting place that you have ever vacationed? And I can't say this one yet because I still haven't been there. And I also don't want to reveal it to you. So the most exciting place that I've ever vacationed was Disney World. And we went in 2007 and it was so but anyway, yeah, comment down below because I'm interested in your life. <laughs> but yeah, I will see you guys on my next vlog, which will be my birthday vlog. So stay tuned. I'm super excited. Bye, guys.